Uh, so many pieces to put back together since the Cerberus attack. We're reeling from the implications. Udina in league with Cerberus trying to murder the Council. These are dark days for all of us. Thought you'd be in the hospital. If I'm breathing, I'm working. Probably the worst I've ever been hurt. Fitting, I guess, given the state of the galaxy. But if Cerberus thinks a few slugs is gonna keep me out of action, they've got another thing coming. Can this station be defended? The internal security breaches have been patched, but we're dangerously low on manpower. We're grilling our own people and trying to figure out if Udina acted alone, but it's time-consuming. All in all, we're still vulnerable, but I think we've taken the right steps. All that time you were working for Udina, did you ever suspect? Always rubbed me a little wrong. Still, that traitorous bastard upped me. Probably made me for an idiot. <laughs> I guess I proved him right. He's dead and you're still here, Bailey. <laughs> Thanks to you. If you hadn't shown up, Udina and Cerberus would be dancing on my grave. How does the Citadel fit into the war now? Uh, the war finally found us. This is so far beyond our imagination, and we have been trained to expect the unexpected. Since the coup attempt, folks are shutting down and shutting in. I hear a lot of praying. And crying. They're saying this is the war to end all wars. Well, I haven't seen anything to say they aren't right. You hear anything about your family out there? Not a peep. I always believed I'd get a chance to tell my ex-wife a few things. And my kids on Earth. I was supposed to visit them. First vacation in years, but I had to cancel when I got promoted. Don't give up hope, Bailey. Thanks, Shepard. I'm really trying not to think about it. I'll leave you to it, then. I'm here if you need me. This is a problem, boss. Cerberus has changed their ciphers, and our code breakers aren't getting anywhere at the moment. I've got our best teams working in shifts on it. But ensuring Citadel systems integrity is just gonna take time. If we can get some of their field encryption tools, maybe sample ciphers. I understand. Keep trying. spouse, correct? I... Yes! How did you know that? We keep identity information on all permanent Citadel residents engaged in formal relationships with Asari. That way, should anyone require diplomatic aid, we can ensure prompt assistance. That's wonderful! Then you can help me send my daughter back to my wife's family? I... I'm afraid, however, that might be a bit difficult. Where? Damn it. How are we supposed to protect? 
get the moves of an enemy we don't understand. Diver 2, do we have any AI-enabled fragments of Sovereign? Any Reaper code I can analyze? No? Well, then they'll keep outmaneuvering our fleet, and a sorry world will keep burning. Recognized. Please select a destination. One moment, please. Now arriving at Huerta Memorial well, Hospital. I'm seeing it here, too. We're low on metagel and synthetic blood, and we don't have enough volunteers. If we could get the rings of a loon from the Salian Nebula, we could declare a cultural crisis. People would have to listen. No, they're not just symbolic. The Asari revere a loon. She wore these rings after learning medicine from a Thame herself. She was like a Dalatress for your people. If we displayed her rings, we'd get more Asari support in the hospitals. Welcome to Serta. Be safe. So you went back to the farm. We snuck down the hill. We were hungry, filthy. They'd turned the towel into a kind of tunic. They'd cleaned up the bodies to make more husks, I figured. But there were still farmers alive. They were being held prisoner. And Neira was there, directing the other forces. I could see her. I, I got within 10 meters of her. I just had my gun. What happened next? I got to the prisoners. The farm girl unlocked their restraints, and... That's when they all started screaming. There's got to be something. I don't know what Cerberus was packing, but we're going to lose this patient. Without a new treatment plan, we're stuck, and I can't think of anything beyond what we've already tried. I know, but I can't think of anything else. Can you? Cerberus soldier during the attack on the Citadel. We can't identify the toxin. We're barely keeping him alive right now. It's some form of neurotoxin. If you could look at our charts... Of course, I understand. Even a general is just one man. Good luck. Who are we to choose who lives or dies? That's not what we do. We help our patients. Can I help you? I'm looking for a Drell named Thane Krios. Well, we have a Drell, but not under that name. He was injured. Stab wound. He's a regular patient here. It's all right. It's all right. I see. The doctors were able to repair a lot of the trauma. However, Mr. Mm. Krios is in the final stages of Keppel Syndrome. At its worst, Keppel Syndrome interferes with his blood's ability to carry oxygen. 
and he lost a lot. Now they've given him transfusions, but frankly, there was a very limited supply of Drell blood on the Citadel. I'll get more. Give me his blood type. That's not going to work. Only one other Drell on the station is a match, and that Drell is in with him now. We did all we could to help him through surgery, but his body can't replace lost blood with new cells. Too much shock. His son, Koliat, he's in there saying his goodbyes. You might want to say yours. Commander Shepard, my father mentioned you were no longer incarcerated. I don't know if you remember me. I'm Koliak Krios. I came to donate blood and, well, he asked me to take off his oxygen mask so he could be comfortable. I don't think it will be very long. Did he tell you he was sick? Yes. Back when I was... When I had my problems with the law, knowing doesn't make it much easier. But at least, here, he'll want to see you. Commander, I'm afraid I won't be joining you again. Never known you to be afraid, Thane. Not a great time to start. Wear down stone and sand. Kalihira, wash the sins from this one and set him on the distant shore of the infinite spirit. Koliad, you speak as the priests do. You have been spending time with them. I brought a prayer book. Commander, would you care to join me? Kalahira, this one's heart is pure, but beset by wickedness and contention. Guide this one to where the traveler never tires, the lover never leaves, the hungry never starve. Guide this one, Kalahira, and she will be a companion to you as she was to me. Koliad. What did the last verse say she? The prayer was not for him, Commander. He has already asked forgiveness for the lives he has taken. His wish was for you. Goodbye, Thane. You won't be alone long. who lives or dies. That's not what we do. We help our patients, all of them. That's a nice sentiment, but it won't help when we run out of supplies. I've seen this happen in combat before. And we will run out of supplies. Have you seen the projections the administration center made? I have. The situation is going to get worse. What's your point? We can't deny the facts. If we prioritize them, some of our patients are in a much better position to survive. If we take care of them first and ration our supplies, we can save some now and enable ourselves to save more later. We cannot do that. We swore an oath to help the sick regardless of their economic situations or their places in society. Who are we to choose who lives or dies? That's not what we do. We help our patients, all of them. That's a nice sentiment, but it won't help when we run out of supplies. 
I've seen this happen in combat before. And we will run out of supplies. Have you seen the projections the administration center made? I have. The situation is going to get worse. What's your point? We can't deny the facts. If we prioritize them, some of our patients are in a much better position. Everyone makes sacrifices in wartime. You'll make yours sooner or later. I'm sure I will. But I'll do it without betraying my oath or my patients. It's not that simple. If we aren't careful about this now, we'll end up losing everyone. Then we'll find a way. Look, we have more fortunate patients, right? Yes. I hate to say it, but the fortunate ones have far better survival odds. <laughs> and more credits. So we ask them for donations, to get more supplies, for those without credits. What? Are you saying what I think you're saying? That's... You know, that, that actually might work. <laughs> Prisoners were indoctrinated. You think? And once the alarm was sounded, Naira's eyes were black the whole time, not just for a second. I could feel her mind from where I was standing. The humans were in the way, attacking us. I used my biotics, flung them around. I... I'd been horrified when Naira tore the farmers apart, but God, it's... I ripped them in half. And it felt good. There's nothing shameful about feeling an adrenaline rush during battle. I might have killed more than Naira and those husks did. She wanted them alive, to turn them. And I... And you survived. Spectre status recognized. Please select One them. moment, please. Arriving at Presidium Commons. But listen, I thought of something. No, it can't wait until I'm back on duty. The Hesperia period. Their statues had legendarily accurate Prothean inscriptions. Can we use that? Yes, I know the Athena Nebula is off limits, but this... A classified project... It needs all the Prothean intel we can find. I haven't found any reliable pictures, but just think. If those statues had something that could help us, even today... It's my money, and I'm closing my account. Your account helps fund Citadel Defense. If you shut it down and hide the money under your bed, it hurts the war effort. And if Cerberus attacks again and takes the Citadel, my money is gone. I'll take my chances on my own. Thank you. So you're fleeing the Citadel? Running to Sanctuary? If you trust the Council, you'll stay here. Why should I trust them? They couldn't stop Cerberus. What could they possibly do about the Reapers? Nothing if you take your money and hide. Have you seen Palavin? Or Earth? You can't escape this war. At least here you've got the Council fighting for you. But to fight? They need money. Money this bank has loaned them using accounts like yours. Okay. Okay, damn it. Leave the account open. Besides, how can some place like Sanctuary promise more safety than the Citadel? You're right. Guess all we can do is hope for the best. Welcome to Elkos Combine Arsenal Supplies. Thank you. Come again. Welcome to Kanala Exports. Thank you for shopping at Canal Exports. Can't believe how hard the doctors are working to keep that terrorist bastard alive. He's in intensive care? He got blasted by Cerberus. They think he's just another victim. Mm -hmm. Krogan are the only race that can fight on the toxic world, so they need support. 
Well, ideally, something like a cacliosaur. They're good in mountains, immune to toxins, ferociously loyal to their riders. Yes, they'd be ideal. Unfortunately, they were driven to extinction during the Rachni War. So, unless we can engineer something new, Krogan on toxic worlds will have to fight on foot without support. Cerberus trap? Bomb or turret? How many this time? Clear the area until you've done a full sweep. We need a way to find their tech and shut it off safely. No, e crime still doesn't have anything. The tech they got off the bodies of a few Cerberus engineers self-destructed when they took it apart. Not much we can do, except pick up the pieces after another turret guns down on mom and her kids. These are control schematics for Cerberus turrets. Will these help? Damn right they will. I'll have E-Crimes dig into them. Might even help us find the little present Cerberus left for us. Thanks a lot. This is gonna save lives. Found another one. Yeah, the guys in Zakara did too. Disarmed there safely. No casualties. Nice work. Found another one. Yeah, the guys in Zakara did too. I just don't understand why you're suddenly so conflicted. Look, the asshole's in custody now. Killing him won't bring anyone back. It's about justice. The man is a traitor and a murderer. You saw what he did to your wife, to my husband. And didn't bat an eyelash. He's evil, there's no doubt. What's going on here? I'm in position at CSEC. Draw them away, and I'll move in and make the kill. Don't answer that. Terrorists. The rest can take care of itself. So the bar fights, the drunken disorderlies down by that purgatory place? How does cracking down on that crap help us win the war? People need to blow off steam right now. And how does letting the misdemeanors go help the war? Less time spent on the light stuff means the Citadel has more money for defense. Everyone on the Citadel knows we're at war now. Cerberus caught c -Sec by surprise last time. You need to make sure that never happens again. That's what I'm saying. Forget the small stuff. Support defense and security and take down anyone who threatens the peace. You make it sound like we're under martial law. After a coup attempt during wartime, maybe we should be. Yeah. You're right. Replacement has been selected. Commander Shepard. Guess I know what happened to my backup. Excuse me? Come on. I'm in C-Sec in civilian gear with a weapon. I know what I'm made. Just let me explain. Captain Aaron Summers, Alliance Marines, retired. Captain Summers? There's a prisoner here. CSEC officer who helped Cerberus. CSEC caught him when you stopped the coup. Now he's offering them intel on Cerberus to get a better deal. Why are you telling me this? Because he doesn't deserve a better deal. He killed people during the coup, good people. And he's former Alliance, like us. The way I figure it, he's our problem to fix. Officer, I'm Commander Shepard. You have a prisoner here, a Cerberus informant. I'm invoking Spectre Authority to take charge of him. Do what you have to do. Thank you, Commander. Commander Shepard, do you have a minute? Mm -hmm. Can I help you? Jordan Knowles, E-Crimes. It's an honor to meet you, Commander. I've got a potential security leak. I haven't seen anything major yet, but better to be safe, right? If you've got time to help, check out this console. Got it. Looks like a collection of access codes. They're Batarian diplomatic codes, from back when they had an embassy on the Citadel. If you can use your Spectre access to find them, I can shut them down. I can access restricted intel at the Spectre office in the Embassy. If I find anything, I'll let you know. 
People have a right to defend themselves. If you start selling weapons to everyone on the Citadel, CSEC will shut this whole place down. CSEC couldn't protect us when Cerberus attacked. I'll take them to court. You think a court is going to want more people running with guns right now? Then I'll go to the wards and sell from the back room at Purgatory. Would a bunch of civilians shooting at anything that moves make the Citadel safer? The commander's right. Maybe if the Council organizes a civilian militia with training. Otherwise, they'll just panic and get themselves killed. I just... I just want people to be safe. I know, but second-guessing CSEC isn't the way. What if we submit a proposal to start a militia? Okay. Welcome to Agor Munitions. Remember, all purchases made by Agor Munitions will... Welcome to Cipertine Armory. Thank you for shopping at Cipertine Armory. Hello, Shepard. Nice to see you. Welcome to Nosostra Sporting Goods. Thank you for shopping at Nosostra Sporting Goods. Welcome to Casa Fabrication Weaponry. Proceeds from all purchases go to Thank help you for shopping and at Casa Fabrication Weaponry. Two hours longer would have gotten the obelisk of Corsa. I know the Hades Nexus is off limits. I'm not an idiot. Damn it, the Alliance needs that thing right now. The obelisk of Carza was supposed to contain Prothean language translations, like the Rosetta Stone for Protheans. Think of how much it could have helped us understand. Shots. I heard the Geth use jamming towers to prevent auto-targeting. If we had tech like that, we might save some lives next time somebody attacks the Citadel. You want my security vids? Bring me a warrant. You're stonewalling me? Those vids could be vital to the war effort. I doubt the Reapers have agents doing business at my cafe. We're trying to protect you. Hell of a job you're doing. You see those scorch marks? Cerberus killed one of my servers right there. Where were you? Hey, I lost friends, too. If you care about finding the Cerberus informants who made it happen, you'll give me the vids. We're at war. If you care about the safety of the Citadel, you'll help CSEC however you can. Thank you, Commander. I have some high-profile customers. If word gets out that I'm ratting them out to CSEC. You think I care about insider trading? Electronic smuggling right now? I'm after the bastards who attacked the city. Nobody else. You've got my word. All right. Just... I hope it helps. Who gets blown up? Spectre status recognized. Please select a destination. One moment, please. Now arriving at wards level, purgatory. The code of the ancients is the collected wisdom of our people. With overwhelming sadness, it was 
new equipment. Send me a set of Vortex armor. Man, summoning supplies shouldn't mess that one up. Oh, I've heard those are pretty good. It's great. I'd only be safer inside a tank. That's why Vortex gear costs more than I make in a year. you got there duty roster for the students it's what I do for fun now they're dropping us into hot spots for hit and runs I'm making sure your bosses don't get my kids killed how are they holding up they are fine they're not the ones reading duty rosters while on shore leave complain if you like but I think military life suits you hey running back to the Alliance was your lifelong dream not mine Come on, plenty of combat, free room and board, and people you can depend on. Yeah, yeah, maybe your little suicide squad taught me something about teamwork. Speaking of which, thanks. I didn't think my guys could cut it. I wanted to put them in the back ranks, but you believed, and you were right. They're kicking ass. It'd be a hell of a lot more fun with you. You find bigger fights, but the little shits are useless without me. I gotta stick with them. Cause I'm dependable now, apparently. I blame you for this, Shepard. Come on. What? The duty rosters can wait. Right now, you're on shore leave. <laughs> Shepard! Everybody knows you can't dance. Today is what matters. I'm not wasting it. I wouldn't have thought a club would be to your tastes. You don't have to get all hot and bothered to appreciate graceful dancing. There's an energy here. There's light. And purgatory serves the best drinks. Here. Here's to fresh beginnings. And a better tomorrow. Thank you. For everything. back on the Normandy. I'm curious. 
What material is your face made from? The surface is a flexible biomimetic nanomaterial over a metallic skull. The skin uses sheer thickening technology to help protect the central processing unit in the head. If the skin is struck or shot, it solidifies to absorb the impact. It also is capable of limited self-healing. And what about the hair? It is of similar construction. For defense, I have set it to cohere into a solid piece. However, for infiltration purposes, it can be parted into individual strands. If it has recently been exposed to water, I generally can't do a thing with it. If I'm not needed to answer an inquiry, I would like some time alone. Look at this! All it took was a Cerberus attack on the Citadel to get folks around here to pay attention to the war! How's this any different from normal? Can't you see the desperation? This isn't happy dancing, this is forget my problems dancing. Look at the arms. If a guy waves his arms like that, he's worrying about a lot more than looking stupid on the dance floor. That's surprisingly observant. I've had time to watch a lot of dancing from the sidelines. Speaking of which... Dancing? watching from the sidelines. What do you think about me and Edie? You know, with all this interest in Edie, it's possible you've overlooked other options. Uh... I, I never really considered it, Commander. No offense. Forget it. So, you and Edie. Well, yeah. What do you think? Why not? Because I could break a bone just from some light over the clothes action? Eh, it's always a risk. But then so are the Reapers. Yeah, I wasn't planning on dating Harbinger. You know what I mean. If we all ended up dead this time tomorrow, what would you regret? Getting a shattered pelvis and a broken heart. Such a stupid idea. If you could be out there right now on the dance floor, would you be waving your arms? Yeah. Sounds like you got bigger things to worry about than looking stupid. Yeah, guess I do. Now, if you'll excuse me... anything yet. That's a start. Look who's here. The Blue Suns, Blood Pack, and Eclipse are in my pocket. I'll send them to war when you're ready for them. Is there anything on your mind? We'll talk later. I'm sure. Spectre status recognized. Please select a destination. One moment, please. Now arriving at Docking Bay E24. Emergency Count, you need to understand what these refugees have been through. Can't you let me in? No. I only need a couple of hours of footage. You're not crossing that dock. Wait, aren't you Commander Shepard? Solik Vaz, documentary maker. Please, maybe you can help. I'm trying to document the stories of the refugees coming to the Citadel. Their loss, their sacrifices, their moments of bravery. 
something holding you back? CSEC won't allow me on the docks. They say I'd be disruptive. But you could catch a few quick shots for me. There are lots of refugees on the rest of the Citadel. It won't have the same impact as seeing crowds trapped on the docks. We all need to help each other. I want this documentary to shock people into action. Good idea. The galaxy should see what these refugees have been through. Thank you, Commander. That's exactly what I'm hoping for. If you could just take a few shots with your Omni-Tool in the refugee camp. I'll be here when you're done. No replacement has been selected for the position vacated by Councilman Denver. I'm sorry, but that's not quite what I had in mind. Yes, that's just what this documentary needs. Enjoying yourself? Yeah, yeah. Try not to lose everything. Those clothes are Alliance property. I have a little faith, Commander. I have a little. You just gonna stand there and watch? You're kind of making me nervous, Commander. I'd ask him to deal you in, but I think they're afraid of you. You're kind of killing my mojo here, Hefe. I was up a minute ago. You just came by at a bad time. You just gonna stand there and watch? About time. Listen, please, we just need more food. Mm -hmm. I can give I you the location the of some ruins. Prothean ruins on Gay Hinnom in the Hades Nexus. If you could get past the Reaper patrols, I'm sure you'd find something valuable. That's got to be worth something. Nice. Please, my family is starving. assumed full control of Eclipse, and we're committed to moving forward with Thara. Damn it, I'm telling you someone sabotaged the Metagel dispensers. No, if I knew who, I'd have had them arrested. It doesn't matter. What matters is that I've got Turian soldiers dying for lack of medication. Damn it, I'm telling you someone sabotaged the Metagel dispensers. No, if I knew who, I'd have had them arrested. It doesn't matter. What matters is that I've got Turian soldiers dying for lack of medication. Pressure's okay. No infection so far. Can I talk to him? 
Only if it's important, Commander. He's hurt bad. Take down the sedative a bit, but hurry. I peg his survival at 50-50. Are you Gorek? <sighs> Go away. Nothing to say. Not even what a terrorist's doing on the Citadel? You! Do I know you? <laughs> Every Batarian with someone on Aratok remembers your face. Planet that got caught in the Alpha Relay explosion. You butchered a colony. Only regret. <laughs> Don't have the strength to. So you just started murdering people. How many did you murder? Don't pretend your hands are clean, you. <laughs> No one here would even be alive if I hadn't destroyed that relay. I spent months taking heat for Aratot from both the Alliance and the Batarians, and you know what? If it saved the entire galaxy, I can live with that just fine. Then why don't you... <laughs> then why don't you get rid of another Batarian for your precious galaxy? <laughs> Shut down this machine. Just let me die. I'm done here. Good. He'll cough himself to death without a sedative. No! Wait! Just take it easy. There. Thank you, human. Welcome to Batarian State Arms. Thank you for your patronage. I have your footage. Thank you, Commander. I'll start editing it right away. Thank you, Commander. I'll start editing it right away. Spectre status recognized. One moment, please. Now arriving at docking bay D-24. I've got your briefing, Private. Let's fill you in before the squad arrives. The Alliance is posting us to an Ezo mining facility on Zani. It's a low-gravity planet, toxic atmosphere. You'll be expected to maintain full survival gear. Any questions? Are we playing security, Sergeant OMB? No, Private. We are not. security at Sonax, and there was definitely Prothean tech on Garvug. I know the Valhallen threshold is Reaper territory now, but Prothean tech could help the cruise. Yes. Yes, ma'am. Yes, I'm aware this is an unsecured channel. Y yes, understood. Thank you, ma'am. duty since Earth was attacked. I understand, but... I can't leave my daughter here alone. I need to send her back to Thessia, to her family. 
These things are very complicated and usually take a very long time. It's even worse with everything going on right now. I'm very sorry. If you can't accept a fostering by proxy until her file is processed, there's nothing more I can do. Thank you. 